Welcome. Today I would like to introduce you to the Enalabs Coriolis Vibratory Gyroscopes. These high-grade gyroscopes are ideally suited for use in a wide range of stabilization control and tactical grade systems. First to give you some background on Enalabs. We were established in Dublin, Ireland in 2011 and have been developing and manufacturing tactical grade gyroscopes and navigation grade accelerometers there since that time. The image shows the entrance to the Enalab site, which houses all of the precision assembly and test equipment required to produce up to 1,000 gyroscope axes and 850 accelerometers per month inside an extensive clean run facility. Here we see the Enalab's team responsible for the design, manufacture, sales, marketing and ongoing customer support of the inertial sensor products shown below. Enalab's is a European supplier of ITAR free products. We have complete ownership of the development and manufacturing cycles and have expertise across all facets of the engineering development cycle, from concept to fully qualified products. We are committed to the highest quality standards and are ISO 9001 certified. What is the history of Coriolis vibratory gyroscopes? The first practical example of a Coriolis gyroscope was by the Marconi Star Gyroscope in 1982, which used a metal cylinder structure for the sensing element. This only achieved very modest performance with a bias stability of around one degree per second. The more recently developed Northrop Grumman hemispherical resonator gyroscope has demonstrated navigation grade performance of less than 0.01 degree per hour. This exceptional performance is achieved partially through the use of silica to fabricate the sensing element, which delivers an extremely high quality factor when operated in a high vacuum and using electrostatic drive and detection methods. Enalab's research has resulted in the development of a high quality factor metal cylinder resonator design, which represents a harmonious blend between the HRG and Stark designs to deliver high performance but at an affordable price. This tactical grade gyroscope achieves a biased performance in the 1 to 10 degree per hour performance range. The research work carried out by Enalab's concentrated on material science, the machining process, the surface treatment, and the heat treatment. All this work resulted in a sensor design with a quality factor of around 100,000, which, with a resonant frequency of 6 kHz, gives a ring down time of around 5 seconds. The resonant vibration mode shape consists of a cyclical deformation of the cylinder from a circle into an elliptical shape, as shown in the image on the right. This vibration mode is excited and detected by means of piezo elements, which are bonded onto the bottom surface of the cylinder. These piezo elements are the 810 rectangular brown structures, which can be seen in the first cylinder image. Locating the piezos on this flat surface, rather than on the curved surface of the cylinder, makes the assembly very simple and cost effective. When a voltage is applied to the piezo element, this induces a strain which deforms the piezo. This change in shape will cause the cylinder on which it is mounted to also deform. By applying an AC voltage at the frequency of the vibration mode, the cylinder can be driven into resonant motion. This motion will deform the other piezo elements and this deformation causes a current to flow across the surfaces. This current is detected and amplified to give a signal directly proportional to the amplitude of motion of the cylinder. In this way, the cylinder can be driven and the motion detected with extremely high sensitivity. Due to the vibration mode shape, some of the piezo elements will see a large deformation while others, aligned to the vibration nodes, will see no net deformation. When the cylinder is rotated, the vibration mode rotates around the cylinder due to Coriolis forces. This is the basic operating principle behind all Coriolis gyros and will be explained in more detail in another Enalabs presentation. The Enalabs 2-axis gyroscope unit contains two sensing elements and the associated analog control loop electronics housed in a very rugged and EMI, EMC and ESD protected casing. The key features of the product are the wide dynamic range of plus or minus 110 degrees per second, minus 3 dB bandwidth of 300 Hz and power consumption of 1.85 watts. There are one and two axis variants available. Also customization of scale factor and bandwidth are possible. Contact one of our sales managers for more details at contact.sales at inlabs.com. Now taking a closer look at the gyroscope's performance. First we consider the output noise. A note on the noise measurement is that the angular random walk cannot be used to estimate the noise performance as the main contributor to the noise is angular noise with a plus two slope up to 200 Hz. 
The graph on the left shows the rate noise measurement versus frequency with a value of under 0.01 degrees per second in a 100 Hz band. The graph on the right shows the angle noise over the same band with a value of less than 0.4 microradians RMS. These exceptional noise performance figures mean that the Inalabs gyroscope is able to provide a low cost and high grade solution for top of the range stabilization and optical sight systems with a bandwidth greater than 150 Hz. Next we consider the bias stability performance as measured using the well-known Allen variance method. This has been measured for an extended time of 32 days in an uncontrolled temperature environment around room temperature as the graph shows. As can be seen, at 150 seconds, the performance is at 0.03 degrees per hour RMS. In fact, on a larger sample size, at 150 seconds, 90% of the parts tested had bias stability of less than 0.1 degrees per hour RMS. At one day, the stability is just 0.7 degrees per hour RMS. The angular random walk is 0.004 degrees per square root hour. This level of performance makes the Inalabs gyroscope product a viable candidate for low-cost north finders. We look next at the bias temperature stability, which has been measured for a sample size of 50 randomly selected units over a temperature range of minus 45 degrees Celsius to plus 90 degrees Celsius with a plus or minus 2 degree temperature slope. The graph on the left shows this performance over temperature for a typical sample gyroscope. The one sigma bias stability is 4.3 degrees per hour, which is comfortably within the 10 degree per hour specification. The graph on the right shows the percentage distribution versus bias temperature stability for the complete sample size. The bias temperature stability performance of the Inalabs gyroscopes makes them suitable for low cost inertial measurement units. Another key parameter is the scale factor temperature stability. This test has also been performed on the same 50 randomly selected units over the minus 45 degrees Celsius to plus 90 degrees Celsius temperature range with a plus or minus 2 degree per second temperature slope. The graph is the distribution profile and shows that 85% of the population is within a 1 sigma 1200 to 1500 range. Finally, considering the bias vibration sensitivity of the gyroscopes, the measurement shown here is for a DEFSTAN 00-35 profile at 3.6 G RMS over a 2 kHz band. The test was performed on three sample units. The picture shows the shaker equipment used and on the right is the output in degrees per hour over time, highlighting when the vibration stops and starts and the effect of the output. Worst case, the output was less than 2.5 degrees per hour per G RMS under 3.6 G RMS over the 2 kHz band. The results were confirmed under 12 G RMS 2 kHz band. In conclusion, the Inalabs Gyroscope 200 series product is in volume production at our facility in Dublin, Ireland. The gyroscope meets the requirements of the stabilisation market with very low output noise of less than 0.4 microradians at 100 Hz, short term stability of 0.03 to 0.1 degree per hour RMS at 150 seconds measured using the Allen method, short term stability of 0.3 to 0.7 degrees per hour 1 sigma over the full temperature range, bias temperature sensitivity of between 2.5 degrees per hour to 10 degrees per hour 1 sigma, and bias vibration sensitivity of less than 2.5 degrees per hour per GRMS under 12 GRMS at a 2 kHz frequency band. The Coriolis Vibratory Gyroscope technology used by Inalabs is capable of being used to branch into a number of different market segments outside of stabilisation. Markets like low-cost north finders or inertial measurement units or low-cost attitude heading and reference systems. We look forward to discussing with you about your gyroscope needs. Make the move to Enalab CVG technology. We are a European supplier of ITAR-free products that offer high performance, excellent quality and high reliability. Our highly experienced and knowledgeable sales and engineering teams are waiting to talk to you about the product that best fits your project needs. Contact us at contact.sales at Thank you.